Researchers in Australia revealed that we can produce concrete that is 30% stronger by processing and adding burnt coffee grounds to the mixture. This recipe can solve many problems at once, one of which is accumulated coffee waste. Every year, the world produces 10 billion kilograms of coffee waste globally, and most of it ends up in landfills. RMIT University engineer Rajiv Roychan said organic waste disposal posed an environmental challenge because it emits large amounts of greenhouse gases, including methane and carbon dioxide, which contribute to climate change. Meanwhile, as the construction market expands globally, demand for resource-intensive concrete is also increasing, giving rise to a series of other environmental challenges. For example, the worldwide extraction of natural sand, usually taken from riverbeds and banks, to meet the demand of the rapidly growing construction industry certainly has a major impact on the environment. Organic products such as coffee grounds cannot be added directly to concrete because they can leak chemicals that weaken the strength of the building material. So, using low levels of energy, the research team heated coffee waste to more than 350 degrees Celsius while reducing the oxygen. This process is called pyrolysis. It breaks down organic molecules, producing a porous, carbon-rich charcoal called biochar, which can form bonds so it can be incorporated into the cement matrix. Roy Chand and his colleagues also tried pyrolysis of coffee grounds at 500 degrees Celsius, but the resulting biochar particles were not as strong. The researchers caution that they still need to assess the long-term durability of their cement products. Currently, they are testing the cement coffee hybrid's performance in freeze, thaw cycles, water absorption, scuffing, and many other stressors. The research team is also working to create biochar from other organic waste sources, including wood, food waste and agricultural waste.